Mr Smith, it's been announced this morning that you've bought um, a big company on the Isle of Man as far as domain names go. It's obviously probably a competitor to yours at some point. That's isleofman.com. Why do you feel the need to buy it? Many reasons, Paul. Uh, first and foremost, Isle of Man .com is, is a very well-run company, so credit to previously owner, owner David Le Prevost, um, who's, who's maintained a wonderful website, Isle of Man .com. Um, and we're delighted to buy that asset because it's, in many ways it's very complementary to our existing Manxnet site. Um, and we're delighted because two, their two key members of staff, James McLean and Chris Kane, also join, join us here at Manx Telecom. It's a great name, first and foremost. Isleofman.com, you can't get a better website name than that. Are you going to merge the two sites? I mean, will Manx.net become Isleofman.com or vice versa? There's no intention to merge the two sites. We see them as quite complementary. And I think the important thing for advertisers on the Isleofman.com is that it's business as usual. OK, so um, we see them as, as broadly uh, complementary. There are certain elements that perhaps will will combine over time. So, for instance, um, we will move to one common business directory that sits across both those sites. Um, but over time, we see them serving slightly different purposes. So, we see isleofman.com um, perhaps as a site you would look to if you're looking out from um, perhaps the UK or other countries into the Isle of Man. Um, whereas Manx.net is absolutely the number one portal on the island and will stay so. Are you becoming more of a media sort of company then? I mean, you started MTTV, uh, and is that where you think the future lies more? Uh, not necessarily, Paul, but our, our business is changing and we need to move to where our customers are, and increasingly that means online. Um, so we see Isleman.com, Manx.net as two key assets for Manx Telecom in the future. Will you be um, buying a radio station next or something? <laughs> we won't be buying a, a radio station next. The, um, you know, media is, media is one part of that proposition online. So if you, if you look at either, either sites, there's plenty of other, um, you know, factors of those websites, whether it's classifieds, whether it's the business directory. So news is just one element. Um, but having said that, as you know, we've recently launched MTTV and it fulfills a gap in the market um, and increasingly people are driven online and they want to see interesting content and video, news video is, is one great example of that and, and MTTV from that point of view has been very successful.